Twitter is one of the most dominant social media network in the world today. If you can build up a decent follower base, you can drive tons of traffic to your website by linking Twitter and WordPress together. Or maybe grow your Twitter following with a fan of your website. Hey guys, Rona here and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can increase your WordPress website traffic by linking Twitter with WordPress. So enough talking, let's get started. To link Twitter account with WordPress, we are going to use GS Twitter Feed plugin. You can find that plugin link in the description box of this video. When you click on that link, you will land on this web page. GS Twitter Feed plugin is a paid plugin. So if you guys serious about boosting up your WordPress website traffic, then I highly recommend you to buy this plugin. This is a must have plugin for your website guys. In order to buy this plugin, you have to click on pricing. And on this website, you have to make an account and then you have to select your plan according to your need. If you have multiple websites, you can choose this package or you can choose this package. Okay. Once you select your plan and you purchase this plugin, then you can go to your purchase history by hovering your mouse over here. On this web page, you can download this plugin by clicking on view detail and download button. Once you download this plugin, don't forget to view your license key. I'm going to click on view license by clicking on this key you can reveal your license key and here you can select your key and you can right click and you can copy it okay and now let's head over to the dashboard of your website so inside your dashboard let's install this plugin let's hover your mouse over plugins and then click on add new and then click on upload plugin and now i'm going to drag and drop my downloaded plugin over here i'm going to drag and drop my plugin over here and now I'm going to click on install now button and now click on activate plugin. Once you activate the plugin, now we have to type a license key of this plugin. I'm going to click on activate. So guys here, paste your license key and click on activate license. So now plugin is activated. Now click on Twitter feed settings. So guys here, you have to paste your Twitter application API key, API secret key and access token and access token secret. So where are you going to get all these text or code? Well, you have to click on this web link. It will take you to this web page, developer.twitter.com. So guys, here you have to create an application. So how you can create that? Well, click on create an app. And here you have to type your application name. So I'm going to type my application name over here. Next, I'm going to type my application description. And next I'm going to type my website URL and I'm going to leave this unchecked and I'm not going to paste my terms and service URL, my privacy policy. I'm going to leave this blank. Finally, I have to tell them how I'm going to use this application for my website. I'm going to use this app to grow my website traffic as well as my Twitter followers with the help of this application. Finally, I'm going to click on create and then click on create once again and your application is ready and now click on keys and tokens so guys here you can see your api key and api secret and your access token and your access token secret over here if you click on generate you can see your access token and your access token secret you can copy them and you can paste over here all right next we're going to leave this unchecked Hashtag would be uncheck. Catch period would be 30. Number of tweets, I'm going to set it to 6. You can change them according to your need. Style and theming, you can choose whatever style you like. Next, date format, link target. I'm going to leave this as it is. Next, Twitter action icon. It depends on your taste. You want to turn it on or you can turn it off. Okay. I like to turn on my Twitter follow button. Okay. Once you're happy, don't forget to click on save changes. Now let's go to user card. Here we have simple settings, styling and theme, theme one, theme two. I like this one. And here you can change your background color and your font color, timeline and collection. Here you have to type your Twitter username. Okay. Leave this blank to collection ID style and theming you can choose rest of the settings are self-explanatory guys i don't want to waste your time to show you things that you already know 
slide settings these are self explanatory as well so anyways whenever you're happy with your settings don't forget to click on save changes now let me show you how you can place your twitter user card or your twitter feed on your website let's head over to your website now i'm going to click on customize let's click on widgets and now click on default let's click on add widgets let's search for gs now we have gs twitter profile card i'm gonna click on that let's drag and drop this twitter profile card on the top so guys now you can see that i have twitter profile card over here but i don't see any twitter follow button over here if i want to display my twitter profile follow button then i have to type a twitter username over here now you can see that i have follow button on my website as well let's click on done let's click on add widget once again let's search for gs this time i'm going to click on gs twitter feed now let's drag and drop this gs twitter feed below the twitter profile card when i do that you can't see anything unless we type our username so i'm going to type my username over here and then click on done and now you can see that my twitter feeds over here as well once you're happy with your changes click on publish so now twitter profile card and twitter feed is available on our website you might think that how these two things going to help us to increase our wordpress website traffic well whenever you write a new post and you publish that post next step you have to do is you have to share that post on twitter you can do this directly from your website or you can copy the url of your post and you can share that post on your twitter profile let me show you how you can do that i'm going to share this post directly from my website let me close this one and let's go to my twitter profile page and now you can see that my website post on twitter profile and whenever your follower watch this post and they will click on that by doing so they will land on your website and this way you can engage your twitter followers to your website moreover if your website fan watch this profile card and they see you are available on twitter as well they can follow you on twitter directly from your website this is how you can grow your website traffic using gs twitter feed plugin so that's the pretty much it guys if you still have any question regarding this video you can ask me in the comment section below if you're new to this channel consider subscribing and don't forget to hit the like button guys that would be appreciated thank you so much for watching this video that being said goodbye and i'll catch you guys next time